Welcome to FOH. This week on Ken's deck. <laughs> it's just been a disaster. But uh, that's just Ken's life, so we're just kind of moving on. It wasn't a disaster until you turned up. Cahiba Robustos. I reckon we did these recently. We did Media Siglo. Didn't they, Cahiba Robusto? I thought we did both. Did we? Maybe we did. Then we're doing it again. You know why? You know why do this again? Because it's in my top five cigars for the year. You no, know why? You know why we're doing it again? Because you forgot we did it. No, <laughs> top five cigars for the year. You know why? Because I didn't make any Siglo Sixes or no Bahikis. So the prime beneficiary of all that has been this cigar here. They've been great all year. The best Coros and, and a lot of cigars have gone backwards in 2018. This is one that's gone forward. <laughs> I, yes. th I thought we did them and we were not as impressed as we thought we should be, or maybe that was, I just had one and wasn't that impressed, but... Uh, I think it was a Medio Siglo, the one that we had. Uh, I didn't think Anyway, I could be wrong, I could be wrong. No, no, I'm, I'm, I remember doing... Uh, I could be wrong, and if we're wrong, we should be showing this next year. But, um... <laughs> First third, Kenny, of this Coro from January 18. Okay. I'm not getting blown away. I'm blown away. I'm not getting blown away at all. It's because you didn't light it properly. <sighs> Look at it, it's perfect. Absolutely freaking perfect. What are you getting out of it? Are you, getting, are you getting medium full? Which is really strange for a Coro. A little bit, uh, just over medium. Just medium. over medium? Just over medium. medium. There's there. a bit, you, there's, if you look, there's a little bit of honey, there's that dry hay. Good coffee. Not so much. No? no? Give it another crack. See if it's lit. Not lit yet? It is. You're going to get shitty. I am right. not. Huh? I am not. Cowboys. Cowboys beat the Redskins. That was last week. It doesn't count. <laughs> He's still getting over it. Hey, we beat Tampa Bay. Oh, who hasn't? <laughs> yeah, we still beat Tampa Bay. <laughs> How's your quarterback situation going? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I'm up next. Um, <laughs> next. You're not getting a little bit of coffee there? Um, Come on. No, I'm not. No, no. You get sweet coffee, mountains of sweet Nothing coffee. Nothing like that at all. Well, I'm surprised. It's I really am surprised. It's a little dry and harsh. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, well, it's cloudy, let's get... Well, yeah, you it's don't give it a perfect. chance. Yeah, well, how's that not a chance? That's perfect. No, Seriously. no, no, no. You, you, you attacked that. That was, that was poor. That was <sighs> poor effort. Well, maybe, maybe the first quarter inch. Yeah, uh... but the problem is that... It, Look well, at that. Suddenly so that, transforms the entire cigar. I'll take a photo of it. Yeah, this and then is, I'll sweep it it's up. It's a perfect ash. Perfect ash. You know, it's perfect burn. I'm getting perfect flavours. Right, it's a bit wonky there. Look at that. Look at that. Well, I've just tapped it off. I mean, what do you it's expect? Like a beaten up red headed stepchild. That is just awful. There's nothing wrong with that. That is awful. That is not the. Look at this. That's the way a cigar should be. That's what you've done to it. Mine's fatter than You much. get exactly. You it's get exactly. Than much. Look at it. It's got a better wrap on mine. But uh, that is exactly what you deserve. Come on, spend a little bit of time lighting your cigars, guys. I mean, spend a little bit of time, a little bit of love. Don't rush it so much. Don't have your mates nag you. <laughs> and you're going to get a lot more out of it at the end of the day. You are. Just a little bit of time. Don't attack it. And it's out. See? Outish. We're we'll back in the second, third. It's glorious. It's brioche. I've just got magnificent brioche all the way through. No? Not getting any of that? See? No. But I mean, you know, I've had some wonderful boxes of... of Coros? Yeah, absolutely. Um, and in fact, I can still remember one that Hamlet picked for me. And God knows what he saw in them, but they were just the most glorious, glorious cigars. Um, he says hello, by the way. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Come over and pick my cigars, please. Um, anyway, yeah. Bring him some Rocky Patel. So, so this sort of, <laughs> that'll do. <laughs> Better than this dog. Oh, oh, oh famous last words. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, look, it's, it's it's not as hot and harsh as it was, but it's still it's still a bit. Um, My glories again. Mm. Treat it well. We'll treat you well. Nine times out of ten. That. So, I'm interesting to see whether, you said it had some elbows to it, actually you didn't say that, but you inclined it. But, um, I inclined it? Inclined it, you, 
Alluded. In, in alluded. To, uh, inferred. Alluded. It's still got some rough edges to it? Yes. Yeah, it still does. Yes. Ammonia? Not so much ammonia. It just, it's just a bit harsh and hot, hot and it's not terribly pleasant. Well, then that's not very good for a Hebrew robusta. It's not. I'm it's, disappointed. It's one, and the last time I had one, I wasn't all that impressed either. Um, but, uh, um, yeah, but normally, normally I would be very happy. Um, well, I don't do the puff, puff, pass, yeah, but um, generally I don't. So I'm not going to let you try this one here. I'm not going to touch it, seriously. You just come out of a, a bowler. Okay. Right, while we're doing the last third anyway, <laughs> we'll be back to you shortly. Ken, I suspect today we're going to get two very different scores on yours. We're finishing the last third now. Um, mine, yeah. was, mine was 92. Good. Mine Solid. Good. About 82. 82? Yeah. Shitty. Um, if this was my first experience, I'd be going, you know, well, why would you ever go back? But, you know, they say nine times out of ten, these are great cigars. Um, this wasn't one of them. There you go. Call it as it is. You have to smoke it. Just put it, put it away. No, it's actually, I'm not getting the same hotness and, and, and sort of, it wasn't grubby, but it wasn't far from it, sort of thing. It, that seems to be a little better now. Just because you lit it. Anyway, let's not go over that. We've gone over that, we've covered that territory before. And I'm sure, Ken, that from here on in, your cigars will be a lot better. Now that you, you mean you won't pick a bad one for me? No, now that you understand exactly the process to get a cigar going in the first place. You never stop teaching, guys. You know, when you see someone who's struggling out there in the cigar world, take a few moments, give them a hand. It makes all the difference. Until next week. <laughs> oh, Until not, next week. Not even your iconic magician will save you from this. I still wear it. Huge female presence we've got. Oh, huge. yeah. Huge. I'm so serious. The two fat old blokes are chick magnets. <laughs> but, uh, why are you blo are you welding? What the frick are you doing? Not so. I'm trying to light it if you a let me alone. Bit, a little bit of class when you're lighting a cigar. Just a little bit. That's a weld. It's just a bloke who anyway, uses his so fingers to dig out a hole at the base. Look at that. It's perfect. Hey? That's absolutely perfect. Can you see that? No. Magnificent. Oh, just as well. Isn't it supposed to be in the centre? Why? Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, is that lit now? Oh, I was sick of getting nagged. Seriously, I can go and visit a mother if I want that. Huh. Why well, you, well, you should do a what not to do. <laughs> I thought about lighting a cigar. I thought Here's an example. Here's an example of not what to do. <laughs> that was every week. Oh, for frick's sake. We'll be back to you shortly. Don't bet on that. We'll be back in the second third. It's going to take Ken through a 101. Back to you shortly. It's actually, there's still smoke coming out, so we're not quite... Yeah, but that's, that's, that's not smoke. What do you mean it's not smoke? It looks like someone's gone through a bucket of water out of the last coals in a fire. That's not smoke, it's not burning. You're having to force it. How is you're that? pumping the cigar yeah, and you're getting it cigar. because you're trying to get smoke out of it. I can see it. You're pumping the cigar. Look at that. You're it's pumping it, so it's, it, it, you can't get... Oh, I've had enough. Back short, I'm so frustrated. Has yours improved at all? It has. It has. I'm not getting any copy or anything. And look at the burn on it. Oh, it's gone better. better to get. No, it's not. No, it's but look, look you're actually burning it. It's, it's, yeah, but it's gone worse. It's amazing how much more flavour you get from a cigar it's when it's lit. It's worse. <laughs> lit. Oh. We had a one-on-one -on -one session. We yeah. went through the concept of... Train, meat, wreck. Seriously. One-on-one <laughs> yeah. -on -one session where we looked at... Had a lighter cigar? No, he yelled at me. Oh, it's good. I give up my afternoon, my deck, my water. Uh, and blow my hole, the cigar's a lot better. Yeah, but it's, um, I think that's, it's not quite... It, You're that, getting a lot that, more uh, flavours, aren't you? Not a lot more, but it's not quite so hot and, and nasty. Yes, he's getting a lot more. He's saying, oh, this is just getting better. Oh, this is not. Oh, you know. It's not hard. It's not he, rocket science, people. He picks people. who gets which cigar. Guess which I got. 
Mine's glorious. I love my cigar. And this is um, just rich. Yours isn't that. Mm, it's, a bit, it's still a bit wonky. See, so this is called an ash. Mine's fatter than yours. I don't. Yeah. Um, what anyway. about this Habanos? 